about to take on Bombay, travelling all the way from the Bombay Hills um, near Pukekohe in Auckland, not as far as our Brisbane Sharks. We're so happy to have them here today and we welcome viewers from Australia that might be watching someone special in this team today. Running through the Brisbane Sharks team, coached by Miriam McCulloch. In goalkeep, we have Courtney McClement, who's our captain. Goal defence, Claire Hassett. Wing defence, Trinity Bobner. Centre, Maya Thomas. Wing attack, Stephanie Kirk. Goal attack, Tegan Toms. And goal shoot, Naomi Russell. Playing a team from Bombay, coached by Mark Knight. Featuring in goal keep, the lovely Olivia Lunn. Goal defence, Amber Knight. Wing defence, Maya Chapman. Centre, Taryn Burnett. Wing attack, Emma Schwass. Goal attack, Hannah Hogan. And goal shoot, Meg Stevens. How's this game going, Tali? Uh, so far, so good. Haven't had anyone fall over yet. Fantastic, because the courts are slippery down here today, folks. And That's we're one, one all the on the scoreboard. It's neck and neck. Oh, and a lovely attempt at an intercept by the Brisbane Sharks wing defence. Putting some pressure on that centre pass. Nice work by the Bombay team to get free and bring the ball in from out of court. And a wayward pass. And the Brisbane Sharks are in position. Oh, what an amazing attempt to control her feet and hold her balance. Unfortunately, um, given away there by the Sharks. And a quick feed out and in by the goal attack for Bombay and a lovely shot to follow. Brisbane Sharks back in position now, feeding to the outside of the circle. That was a cross court in contact court. Looking to feed a little closer, the goal shoot for Brisbane. Putting the ball up in a nice regain after a missed shot. Second attempt and successful. And we're two, two all. all. It's tight here in Fitianga today. Oh, what right a intercept. beautiful intercept. Taking it straight down the middle. Back in the hands of the Brisbane shooters, looking to put their third goal away for the day. Unfortunately, a miss there, followed quite often by an obstruction and a desperate attempt to regain possession and an obstruction called again. Brisbane Sharks working hard on every ball for their team and for their country today. The only uh, team representing um, our international participants in the tournament coming all the way from Brisbane. That wet weather is really affecting the girls out there today. Yes, it will be, but un unsurprisingly not affecting the Brisbane Sharks, who I imagine would have come from some beautiful sunny weather. <laughs> so they're playing really well in the wet, uh, wintry conditions here today. That was another goal for the Brisbane Sharks, taking them to three points over two today. Still not a lot in it, but I have to say the Brisbane Sharks are looking dominant in their position in this game. What a beautiful intercept. Um, and so the call there was offside by the Brisbane wing attack prior to the intercept or the tip. Bombay looking to bring it through the court. They're in their shooting circle. And again, Brisbane Sharks working hard. So Bombay in position at the top of the circle there. 
and a contact call on the outside. Can their shooter put it away to take the score back to a draw? Tali, it's neck and neck. A little bit too much there. Yes, wind may be playing a factor in the game. And then that pass. Some really lovely umpiring today. We've got Chelsea McLeod umpiring uh, Bombay and Siobhan Flesher on this side umpiring the Brisbane Sharks. Oh, and a great attempt to keep the ball in court by Brisbane centre. Unfortunately regained by Bombay as they work to bring it down to their shooters. Feeding back into their goal keep third. They're crowding a bit together. I think they need to spread out a little bit. I would agree. I'm sure their coach will be looking to chat to them about that in the break. We're under one minute remaining in the first half. Feeding out to come in again. And there's another goal for the Sharks. Back into the lead. Brisbane Sharks 4-3 to three and in possession on the centre pass. Yes, unfortunately, a misunderstanding there by Brisbane's goal attack and finds herself in the centre third before the whistle was blowing. So a breaking call sees the ball back in Bombay's hands. Got 20 seconds left on the clock. So I think Bombay's going to try and get one in. Can they bring the score back to a draw in the dying seconds? She takes a brave step towards the goal defence and the umpire sees that as obstruction, interestingly. And there we go. Just we, the time, right? It's four all at half time. We'll see you shortly. One minute to go. So we're back into the second half. The clock is counting down. We're four all. Bombay, Sh uh, Bombay playing the Brisbane Sharks. Bombay in position here. Now I can see the pep talks fired everybody up in this game that's neck and neck right now. Obstruction called. And straight into the circle there to the Bombay shooter and a lovely goal scored. So Bombay take the lead by one. Oh, and a big cross-court pass. Bombay hunting it and causing a turnover in the back there. Oh, and we have a loss again. So, folks, we're uh, neck and neck still. So, the Bombay team in position as we bring the ball through the court. A nice clear pass there by Bombay. Obstruction on the outside. Next to the goal defence, oh, Brisbane Sharks having a really great attempt to cover two players in there. And a loose goal attempt, back in position. And there it is, Bombay slots another goal.
And a lovely, a lovely tip there by Brisbane Sharks and a nice intercept in reply. It's a desperate game here, folks, as everybody looks to win. And unfortunately, slipping through the hands of the goal shoot out the back of the court. We're back in the hands of the Brisbane Sharks. She's looking for her teammates. Nice driving by the wing defence to get available for her player. I'm liking this Brisbane centre. She does a lot of work bringing the ball through the court. She's taking every second ball almost. Really leading the way. And that was a lovely drive out by the goal shoot. Across court passes. Always risky to do an across court pass over the heads of a couple of defenders, but it's paying off for the Brisbane Sharks who swing it across the court to um, find their shooters free on the other side. So the scoreboard says 5 6 to Bombay. Oh, that was a lucky pass, and a tip off Bombay sees it feeding in with the Sharks. Oh, and a replayed ball down there. Heartbreaking stuff, I'm sure, as they seek to balance that scoreboard and take this win today, our visitors from across the sea. There's our centre again, working for everything. Some lovely play here today in this under-15 section. Our future premier players, I'm sure. Oh, that was some lovely footwork by the Gold Defence. Just a second too late in the eyes of the umpire there. So we see the ball in Bombay's hands. With three minutes 18 remaining in this half, and that was a lovely goal scored by Bombay. And Bombay has seen a pass again. the wind still blowing and it seems to be playing a factor in this game as the ball slips out the court there being fed in by the Brisbane goalkeeper looking for her centre someone standing down means there should be free players as they bring the ball through the court and there she is our centre free again Working really hard, the Brisbane Sharks, to bring the ball down and level up that scoreboard. That was a brave pass, heading through the hands and out the back. And there we go again. Same in return by Bombay. So Brisbane Sharks with another chance at goal. Slippery ball there with the wet weather. Yes, it did look to slip through her hands. She thought she had it. Bombay. Oh, how cool. It's the Brisbane Sharks bringing it through again. Just a little late on that pass, I felt. A ball release quicker might have seen the wing attack in position. Bombay in position now, working hard to bring it down. Feeding back and a step. Quick. Quick turnover by the Sharks. They're in their goal third already and looking for a goal. We're 7-5 on the scoreboard at the moment. And we're going for a goal and that's an obstruction called. And there we go, folks. 7-6, nothing in at 1 minute, 18 remaining. And the Brisbane Sharks have turned it over with only one minute left to go. 7-5 on our scoreboard. <laughs> 50 seconds left on the clock. Sharks is taking it down to their court. The Brisbane Sharks three. in position. And they pop it out the back there. And a wayward pass by Bombay. It's throwing in. Throw in Brisbane Sharks. 23 seconds to go.
And the sideline screaming at their shouts to pop a goal in. Quickly get a goal and their ball's up. Out the back, back in the hands of their shooter and she slots the goal. Just in time, three seconds left. The claps on the other side. We're just waiting to see what that final score was. Our scoreboard says 7-6 to Bombay. I don't see any cheering on either side. I wonder if we've missed a goal here. We're finding out for you folks all around the world. I'm sure there's some Brisbane supporters wondering what that final score was.